know they gotta chill I pull out the tool, I make pop for real I been running bad like I got the steel What's going down, Clutch? What? What up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Duck. It's your boy, Ross. And we're in the Clutch. Hey, hey, back to you, ladies and gentlemen, with another BG, you feel me? 11 scariest things caught by it. Drones. Mm. Them drones this, are expensive, man. This is Ross in his bag. He in his scary bag. I'm, <laughs> I'm telling him we need to get jolly, man. We we on the Christmas vibe. We trying to get to that happiness. Santa low key kind of creepy, bro. Because the dude come in your house late at night. I ain't necessarily say off. Santa, but, but mean, if, we if you want to get into bag, that bag. I'm just saying, man. He does come down your chimney. And if you don't have a chimney, he just pops out of nowhere, eat your cookies right. and milk. And give you gifts. That you leave off for him. It ain't like you put it in the refrigerator. But then he just went in there. He decides if you're good or not. So he'll just give you coal. But you know if you was good or not. But what if you was good? And then he I still gives you I, coal. He don't make mistakes like that. Bro, coal is hard to clean up. Be good then. Bro, no one's always good 100% of the time. Right, but you know, if you're a good majority of the time, you know. Man, there's a, maybe, there's a good maybe and bad. Christmas Eve you had a bad day and you said, F it. I'm taking somebody out. You know on, what I'm saying? On, on Christmas Eve? Damn, whoa. What are we talking about here? <laughs> what you That's mean taking them out? Day. Taking them out how? I don't know. Yeah, you're <laughs> not you, going to get it. You had a really bad day. Oh, you're you going to really be it. in jail or something like that. Well, if you don't go to jail, you just go home. <laughs> then you're soon going to be j- in jail. You Bro, need to be turning yourself in for whatever you did. Does that person still deserve coal after that? You had one bad day. Yeah, you deserve a coal sale. <laughs> <laughs> I did, all I said was take him out. You take him out to Chick Fil A. Nah, hell no, nah, bro. <laughs> that, that was it. F it. I'm taking him out. <laughs> really? To go get a Cobb salad? But nah. Uh, so eleven scary things caught uh, caught by drunk. <laughs> so um, <laughs> let's check this out and let's see what kind of weird stuff on them drones. Was to explore areas that we would otherwise never dare Not step Not the voice foot again. In. And as they fly what through the, the sky high above. They sometimes catch things oh, that were wow, never meant crazy. to be witnessed by Holy the human wow. eye. Number 11. Oh, this this drone footage was taken somewhere I deep in the Salt too. Fork Park in Thanks. Ohio. The video starts out Speaking ordinarily enough, but then sometime around the five minute mark, you might be able to see something hiding in the thickets. Watch the left side of your screen closely as the drone starts to land and pay close attention because it happens pretty fast. What the fuck is that? Alright, I see the left side. What is that? <laughs> Many people claim they can see a large creature stop and look up as the drone passes by. It probably was. Some even good, claim bro. that this is a Bigfoot sighting in That's broad good, daylight. Bro. I do see what they are talking about, but I personally don't see any movement, and I think it could possibly be a tree. Maybe. Let me know if you see it and if you agree. Number 10. When a freak thunderstorm sets this large hay field on fire in Weld County, Colorado, a brave farmer named Eric Howard hops into his tractor and heads straight for the action. He has a wild plan that's about to greatly help firefighters contain the 30-acre blaze if it all goes well. Okay. Thinking fast, Eric quickly carves a long path across the field to keep the fire from spreading. Mm. It's a firefighting strategy called a fire line, which is where you remove the top soil so that there is less material to burn. He barely manages to stay ahead of the inferno, and the dancing flames grow tall enough to melt the paint off his trusty tractor the whole time. Damn. Eventually, the wildfire is contained, and Eric is credited by the firefighters for oh, his gutsy plan, okay, which here. probably saved additional acres from oh, going yeah, up in yeah, flames. Let up. me know what you would do in this situation, and okay, if you here. think Eric should have left it to the professionals. Oh, no, Number did nine, thing, did a thing. predator combat yeah. drone is conducted a routine patrol when suddenly something huge and fast enters its airspace. What appears to be some kind of unidentified flying object streaks by the drone. In a gigantic burst of white light, the drone turns around to scan the area, but whatever zoomed past is now long gone. Unfortunately, no further footage was recovered. I don't know if the lack of information surrounding this video is a sign that it's fake, or it means the military simply isn't saying anything. The unidentified flying objects could be CGI, but outside of that possibility, what you are watching could very well be our first contact with very technologically advanced extraterrestrials. 
Number eight, Could be. a YouTuber named Run Gun Griff is a drone enthusiast who explores a lot of exotic locations on his channel. Most Look of his videos view. are taken on tropical islands, but this one was shot at a hard to find rural spot that he simply describes oh, as being in the, the middle of, of nowhere. Drone. As his drone flies high, you can see that Run Gun Griff and his friend are standing in the middle of a huge field of crops that's covered in a series of strange markings. The symbols themselves are perfectly symmetrical yeah. and extremely precise in their geometry. Yeah. Their designs look strikingly identical and appear to have no noticeable differences, a sign yeah. that it was not made by humans. It looks I suppose that it would be possible to do this with farm equipment, but farmers have little reason to vandalize their own yeah. field, and since there's absolutely no flaws in the design, I think that there is a strong possibility that good this footage. was made by something yeah. extraterrestrial. Let me know if you think that these crop circles are man-made or extraterrestrial in nature, mm. and if you recognize any of these symbols from any literature, movie, or video games, then I'd definitely right like there. to know yeah. where they are from. Maybe it could have been some Number other seven. A YouTuber named Furious Otter is piloting his nosy drone across a long stretch of woods when he comes across a mysterious all-white object that doesn't match the native scenery. Okay, so he, he grows curious and decides right. to take the drone closer to the ground to get a better look. It's a decision that he probably now regrets. It doesn't look like much at first, but the situation becomes much more clear after he zooms in. Whoa. Oh, wait! Oh, A witch like figure appears to crouch low while watching the drone from the tree line. I can't tell if they are waving at them or brushing something out of their hair, but either way, this strange hermit just shouldn't be out here this deep God, in the woods. <laughs> This video is terrifying if it's real, but a couple of things make me question its authenticity. I know drones can get a lot closer than that, so why didn't he try to get closer to see if they needed help instead of immediately flying away? <laughs> I guess he could have been worried about losing his drone yeah, or possibly even getting cheap. cursed, so he just got out of there fast instead. If that's the case, that's exactly then I can't say I blame drone. him. Let me know what you think you would have <laughs> done if you the were there. Are definitely not cheap. Number six. Oh, this news drone records the aftermath of a giant blast that rocked a residential district in Westminster, Colorado. The giant smoldering crater you are looking at was once a home, and even worse, the blast was done on purpose. The owner of the home, 59-year-old Gary Pine, was living all by himself when he decided to take his life in a very vengeful way. He disconnected his natural gas line oh, and let no. his house fill up with gas oh. until it blew, blowing off the side of his neighbor's house oh, and sending no. debris flying across two whole blocks. Jeez. No one knows exactly why he did it, nor will they ever feel completely safe in their home again. Number 5. Damn, These man. National Geographic explorers are using high-tech drones to map out the inside of a churning volcano for the very first time. What? Their drones are able to get close enough to the lava to capture shots that would boil a human alive. The thousand degree temperatures claim more than a few drones during the study, of and each one is an expensive loss. These drones use sophisticated 3D technology to map out the bottom of a lava pit, something wow. that has never been done before. You can even see an evil looking entrance where the high pressure magma shoots out of the volcano. The drones also have another purpose too. They let researchers measure exactly how close to the edge they can get before the incredible heat becomes too much to stand. Let me know if you think you'd be brave enough to do this kind of research, I'm or if good. you'd rather have a safer I'm occupation. Good. I can watch it Number home. four, <laughs> an Australian YouTuber named Simon Lawrence is flying his drone high above his boat in Port Lincoln. He and his like friends it. are looking to catch crabs, but soon they find something else entirely lurking in the deep ocean waters. Shark! Shark! <laughs> oh, yeah, he waiting too. The Don't great white shark boat. seems to silently study them for a bit before coming in for a closer look. Oh, wow, that's too close of a look. Like he came. Back. <laughs> That's when the close. shark shows interest in their crab pot, of they course. wisely cut it loose and watch the shark swim away. 
Simon and his friends are very lucky because great white sharks have been known to try and overturn boats by swimming straight into them at full speed. Number three, oh, nah, bro. this drone oh, video was know. taken in late 2016. Golden Hour is a YouTuber who is apparently just trying to get some aerial shots of his small town when he stumbles upon something that definitely doesn't belong in a cornfield. It kind of looks like an ordinary scarecrow at first, but then you can see it's a clown in a bright orange outfit with equally colorful what hair. The, hell? the strange and unfriendly clown glares at the drone before sprinting away at <laughs> full speed. It makes its way into the mouth of the forest shortly, and the drone Literally. takes off back to safety. I, I have questions right. about this video that are similar to number seven. If this video is real, then once again, I don't understand why the drone operator didn't pursue the clown <laughs> further <laughs> to figure out where it came from. I guess the clown could have just been a friend in a costume, but then again, maybe this was one of the many real clowns caught trespassing on. So I definitely like to get your opinion. Number two, a YouTuber named Justin Brown has been seeing odd looking people living in tents near his hometown mm. in Lompoc, California. He is too nervous to investigate the situation in person, so he sends his drone over <laughs> for a closer bad. look. Mm -hmm. Imagine Justin's surprise when he discovers an entire colony of strangers living on a riverbed less than a mile from his home. Whoa. He has no idea who they are, what they want, or why they are so close to a suburban neighborhood which doesn't seem particularly special in any way. Also, no one can seem to figure out what this mysterious blinking blue light is. Take a look at the way it keeps flashing persistently and tell me what kind of technology you think it could be. Maybe together we can figure out who lives here together. and their purpose. Yeah, I'm figure it out. Before we get to number one, my name is Chills and I hope you're enjoying my narration. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram <laughs> at Dylan is Chillin YT Dylan and tap that chillin'. follow button to Dylan find out. Chillin'. I'm currently doing a super poll on my Instagram. If you <laughs> believe is it, so surreal, know how I look then go to my life. most recent photo and tap the like button. Oh my God. If you don't, DM me saying day number one a youtuber named chris lamb says that if you shop on <laughs> amazon chilling. you should use capital chilling, one man. shopping because he is it's a chilling. browser extension <laughs> he was all alone when no he alone. shot this drone footage at fork mcclellan alabama okay. but the video says otherwise you can clearly see that nobody is in the background at the beginning He's just having fun with his drone. But when Chris steadies the camera just a moment later, you can see someone standing by the street lamp. There's not enough time for anyone to walk out from behind a building. Oh, you see? But him? yet, here yeah. they are. Ah, oh, nah, bro. <laughs> also, did you see how they seem to suddenly disappear in yeah. plain sight? I don't oh, see nah, any bro. editing cuts, so I have absolutely Wait, no hell? idea <laughs> how this dark silhouette yeah, managed to nah, vanish bro. like that. Look again and you can definitely see them dematerialize. There's nothing wide enough for them to hide nah, behind. Bro. They're just gone. Let me know if you think Chris Lowe's oh, video is paranormal, extraterrestrial, or here. otherwise. You. <laughs> A live broadcast oh, can Jesus. capture unusual content that was never intended to be the main focus of the oh, show. What's going on with I that encourage you in the to background. take a look at these strange happenings caught live uh, and oh, try to help man. me make sense of them. Hey, Maybe if y'all want us to check that out, look, we definitely will, because that was, That's man. That's crazy. <laughs> See, this scary, this, this weird, creeped out stuff, man. It's weird. <laughs> Nigga just popped out of nowhere watching him play with his drone. Really weird, man. <laughs> and then he just disappears. <laughs> okay, I'm done here. I'm sorry, I'm just not going to play with no drone in the, like, by yeah, myself. Yeah, in the middle of the, like, a parking lot at night. night. Yeah, just by myself. With my back turned to whatever, I ain't got no security. Something come. <laughs> all you, all you know it takes you feel is that, you know when you feel that something coming. Yeah, bro. <laughs> That's just me personally. Some niggas are brave. Yeah, yeah. Y'all braver than me, cause at night I'm I'm, I'm trying to be at home, <laughs> somewhere cozy. In the comfort there. of walls. Yeah, you know I what I'm saying. See where you my can, escapes you, are. You can use the drone at another time in the daytime where people are around, maybe. <laughs> We ain't put that. Nah, random parking lots. You got random people in the middle of the night. <laughs>
<laughs> just oh look. shit, boy! I tell you, you sometimes you wonder why some people get in situations. Uh, oh, facts. That's man. why. That that right there. Facts. But now nah, let us know if y'all enjoyed the video, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Again, mm-hmm. if you want us to do some more of these, comment down below. Run up them likes as well. We'll facts. be known. Uh, we'll know. Excuse me, that we should check out some more of this. Make mm-hmm. sure y'all hit post notification as well. You'll be notified as soon as we upload. And uh, let us know if y'all got some drones, man. If y'all do got some drones, let yeah. us know, man. And, and, you know, give us some advice on which ones we should probably cop. Yeah, you know, let I us know. Because I, I actually do want to invest in a drone. I think that would be some pretty cool footage you can get with that. Mm-hmm. That's some dope cutaway footage, dope vlog footage. Whenever we're able to actually travel safely throughout the country, I think that would be pretty cool uh, to get, like, some potential drone footage somewhere out mm-hmm. the states or out the country. You never know. So. Factuals, factuals. Again, love you guys, man. Stay safe out there in them COVID streets. Don't you ever forget. We're getting a clutch, baby. Already. I've been through this, been through that, reminiscing on my past. I found bliss in the way that I carry on my back. Let my soul sing my song. It goes Ooh, na, 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 na. I still rose from all my lows I say